What's up guys? It's me, X Mr. Cheese X here, and welcome back to more of Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. Last time we got into Lavender Town and I've gone on a huge rant about how about the morality of replacing a mausoleum with a radio tower. Yeah um I'm, I'm still kind of upset about it, but the reason why I'm being gone for a couple of weeks is because I don't think I actually brought it up in my videos, but I actually had to move down to a new place, and, oh, I never knew it was part of music, but I'm getting sidetracked. But I'm basically moving, it being pretty rough, we're still not 100% settled in, but it's really starting to feel like a home now. Um, I only got in my desk and computer set up here just a couple of days ago, so yeah, been a while since then. And also, guess what happens, I'm recording this on the 28th of June, and Guess what day it was? Doo, 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 doo. N my graduation. That's right. I'm no longer a high school student. I got myself registered into college. Got my schedule all filled out. It's actually coming along very nice. But anyways, enough about what's going on in my life and coming up with an excuse to not record. Here we are on Route 10. Now, there isn't any new Pokemon here, and I did promise I was going to um, find the trainers down at that route, but I forgot to, and I'm going to continue avoiding trainers unless it's absolutely necessary. I can spend time grinding. Um, this is a trainer that I can't seem to avoid at all. Oh, oh, oh. oh you Dracula. But as you can tell, we're gonna have to go up against the dreaded... You know what's up, it's Rock Tunnel. And just like in the other Pokemon games, it's pretty long. Now, so I'm pretty annoying, and I don't think I got re any repels. I gotta go back after this battle and pick up some more bells, or else this is gonna be a really annoying area. But, anyways. But yeah, the color's coming around. I got my entrance exam. Got my head and. Fit out my schedule, like I said. So, pretty much, I'm all. Said I start college um, on the 28th of August. Classes actually begin on the 2nd of September, but anyways. It's just computer programming and oh, you're the one with hay heat fever. Yep. And yep, actually, I should go back and check if Lavender Town has any repels. Okay, they're max repels, so it's gonna have to make do with that. I prefer super repels because you get more for your money, but... Anyways. Real dead, really in Tinny, Rock, Lavender Town. Well, here we are, going into... Rock Tunnel at... Ah, uh, Stark. Ugh. Well, I might as well go ahead and talk about the... New Pokemon here. There's only two new Pokemon here. First we have Kangaskhan, which is pretty rare here, and which is pretty rare here, and they haven't changed too much from the previous generation. They have high HP and pretty good stats, but not very good moves. It does have Reversal, which does damage equal to the amount of HP Kangaskhan has lost, but I don't really find it at useful unless you're sure that you can get down to 1 HP and survive him with those pretty good defense and really high HP. Well, actually, no. Reversal would be great if it has high HP. What am I talking about? Next we have Cubone and it's evolved for Marowak. Pure ground type. 
and has the exclusive new Bone Rush. A gun attack that can strike two to five times each turn. It's a ground type two, making it really great against fire, electric, poison rock, and even steel Pokemon. It also has Boomerang and can learn False Swipe, which is great for low right, for nah, not lowering capturing wild Pokemon because it because well ah, I can't pronounce my words. False Swipe reduces the Pokemon's HP to one if they. Um, are faded by that move. If they would have faded normally. But, anyways, I'm actually gonna go ahead and speed up this video, so. Yeah, um, enjoy the music, whatever I choose. Okay, that wasn't bad, and I'm just going to say something embarrassing. I actually got in lost and I restarted the game somewhere in the video. And <laughs> then uh, everything is kept consistent, though, though suitable, and Sunbo got experience from that battle, so don't worry, nothing changed. At least nothing noticeable. And well, right here is a Pokemon Center and a expired repel. Can you call it expi expired? It's more like War Office effects, more like it. Though it doesn't want it quite as smooth as just saying expired. Because, then again, that will probably would be the case. I mean, you would think, do you? It pretty much implies that you spray the entire can on you to keep it. Yeah, that will keep Pokemon away. It should keep trainers away as well because of that, but. Ugh. 
I mean, can you imagine using an entire can of repel all over your body? I mean, ugh. But anyways, here we are in a Pokemon Center. Um, best thing to do is save right here because we're near the power plant. Where we'll get finally get to see what's going, what's wrong, which I don't get because for the third time, look outside. Lights are perfectly fine, but apparently there's something wrong with the power plant that is actually right there. So I have no idea. Uh, Anyways, like I said, this is a good place to save. Um, I'm gonna end this video right here. Uh, oh, next time on Let's Play Pokemon Crystal, we're gonna go off through Route 9 and arrive at the power plant to see just the heck is wrong or not wrong or whatever people are complaining about because they're saying that they're not getting electricity even though that there's lights on and i don't see any candles anywhere so i guess i'll see you guys then